Hello everyone. I've been having a few video requests recently and one of them is to make a guide on how to play the 2007 servers on the official RuneScape client and this is a feature that has been added recently by Jagex and they did put some instructions in the official RuneScape wiki but I find these instructions might not be the best for people who aren't very technologically savvy because yeah there aren't any pictures or not many pictures anyway and it might be a bit confusing so hopefully this video will be more straightforward for a lot of you or anyone who might be having trouble. I do have instructions in the description if you'd like to read through those rather than watching this whole video. Uh, I recommend doing that if you've uh, maybe if you've adjusted the client when the beta servers were out because this process is almost exactly the same. Uh, so anyway I'll get right into it then. So the first thing you need to do is navigate to the folder that is the uh, the Jagex launcher folder and I've put a path name uh, what it is for me on screen here but it may be slightly different for others of you. I mean it will definitely be slightly different unless your username is also Omar which is somewhat unlikely but possible I suppose. Uh, so uh, yeah, you have to navigate to there. It'll be in your uh, computer, local disk C, users, then your username, then Jagex cache, and then Jagex launcher. There's also another option. It could be under your documents and settings, uh, but just yeah, find this folder. And then uh, you need to copy over the RuneScape folder. So just make a copy of it and then re rename it old school. Then open up that folder and you'll see a file called runescape.prm and rename that file to oldschool.prm. If you don't see the .prm file extension, that just means that you don't have that enabled to be able to be seen, but it's still there, it's just hidden. So don't worry about it, just rename the file from runescape to oldschool and just ignore the .prm. And then after you change the file name, you need to open it up and you need to open it with a plain text editor. This is something that's not going to do some weird stuff with formatting like Microsoft Word would. So open it up with something like Notepad or WordPad or TextPad, Notepad++, uh, something like that. Uh, just something basic. Most computers should have Notepad. I don't really know any that wouldn't really, uh, besides Macs, but I, I don't explain that in this video, sorry. Uh, so what you need to edit in here is this line that I have highlighted. I have what you need to change it to in the description, so just copy that over and paste it right over that entire line, and then save and close that folder. And then the next thing you need to do is go to wherever your RuneScape shortcut is, so whatever you open your RuneScape client with, you need to go to that, mine is in the taskbar, so I right click on it, I go to properties, and that shows me the properties of my RuneScape client. And so then I need to click on the thing that says open file location and this will take you to where the actual executable file is which runs your RuneScape client. So then copy that jagex launcher.exe. As you can see on screen, I actually have the jagex beta launcher from when I did the client for the beta servers. It doesn't matter if that's in there for you or not, don't worry about it. And so you copy the .exe and rename it to whatever you want. I called mine jagex old school launcher.exe, which I think is a reasonable name. And so then you need to make a shortcut to that executable. So for me, I pinned it to my taskbar. Uh, you could also go and just right click and go to create shortcut and put it wherever you want. Uh, it makes sense to do it wherever you have your normal RuneScape client, in my opinion, but it doesn't have to be. Uh, so once you make the shortcut, then you open up its properties just like you opened up the client properties before. So you right click on it. For me, it was in the taskbar and then go to properties. And so now I've got the two things side by side just to show you what it's like. So on the left is the regular RuneScape client and on the right is the new one that I just made. And so how the RuneScape client works is it takes in a parameter. So on the left, I have highlighted the word RuneScape and that tells it to look in the RuneScape folder for the .prm file. And so in order to make it run the old school client, you need it to go to the old school folder. So you change the one on the right to say old school launcher.exe space old school. And then you just apply that, press OK, and then you just run the shortcut there. And if everything went correctly, it should work. Uh, so yeah, that's really it. Um, uh, so yeah, I don't really have anything else to talk about in this video. Please give it a thumbs up if it was helpful to you and enjoy the 2007 servers.